is Alex, and I started this campaign along with my cousins Elise and Storm. Um, we kind of noticed that there was difficulty with the community members getting items, especially during uh, the coronavirus pandemic. And on top of that, we already had difficulty getting things just because the nearest stores are like 45 minutes to an hour and a half away. And we just wanted to make it more convenient for everyone. And so instead of talking about it a lot, we just decided to spring into action and do something about it. So we launched this campaign and the execution took us about a month, maybe a little more. And I mentioned this to Patty at CEI and you know, she just sprung right into action and so did CEI. So we got a lot of support from them and we're really thankful for that. We also started launching a PSA video just about the coronavirus and to keep our community members educated on how it's going. I'm Elise and I'm one of Alex's cousins. So about a month ago when we started this, she just like out of the blue texted me and was like, hey, do you want to do this? And I was like, oh yeah, sure. So at first it was just for fun and then we realized how important it was. Just basically trying to inform our Hopi community and others like with the convenience stores and just trying to raise awareness of the virus that's going on right now. So we created a PSA video, got in contact with a doctor from Phoenix who was able to elaborate more on what the virus is and we're able to shoot b-roll and just like anything around the reservation that revolves then just trying to like let others know to be safe and what standards they should be following and just to protect others and to keep healthy lives you know continuing because healthy lives matter. Hi I'm Storm, I'm one of Alex's other cousins. When we first started this project, we didn't think it was going to grow as big as it did, but we're glad that it did and we're so thankful to the people at CEI and all of Alex's amazing co-workers for helping us push this through. I think we realize how important it is because we do have a lack of water already due to arsenic. We we'll have to travel 45 minutes to an hour and a half to get this. It is important for our people to stay informed because we are such a small tribe. It is easy for it to spread. Like just look at Navajo Nation, it's already gone so out of hand. So we're just trying our best to make sure that we don't get to that point and to make sure that we take care of everybody and all of our people.